to Frostpunk since it suddenly got cold here. I figured I would uh, load up Frostpunk and play it again. I've never, I've never played it too in depth. I mean, I've beaten a few times. I got in a lot of tunes. Like I, I have actually gotten the Golden Path. It was on you know just the regular normal difficulty. I'm gonna try to do the main scenario on a hard difficulty. See if I can you know get through it or if everyone dies. You know. That's gonna be how it, uh, it goes. Anyway, let us begin. Welcome to the last city on Earth. Or, or the game says, you know. There's other stuff going on, too. Yes, I do still have the active pause because I am not super pro player at this. And like I said, I've beaten the game uh, multiple times on normal. I've gotten you the golden path, but I'm also playing on hard, hard now, so, well. Harder, yeah, hard, because then there's extreme, yeah. So things are going to be more difficult on me, and everyone's probably going to die. Doo -doo -doo. I get some crates there. First thing I'm going to do, which may or may not be the best choice in terms of starting off, I don't know, is I'm actually going to do child labor. Because we need, we need people to do things. People and stuff and get some workers there. Do, do, do. Okay, got two workers there. Okay, now two on crates, one on steel, one coal pile. I see what they mean by uh, resources taking longer to gather on this difficulty. Put them there and put the kids on gathering wood crates. Uh, I didn't realize you didn't start with any reasons. For some reason I thought you started with some. But, uh, I don't know. Kids should be learning not working. Well, they're working right the fuck now. But yeah, I do love this game just because uh, I avoid... Always, I don't know, for some reason, games that have cold, winter kind of stuff, they just appeal to me for some reason. I don't know if it comes with living you know, near mountains or some, some crap like that or not, or I'm just weird, but I don't know, it just the whole oppressive coldness just feels like an enemy on its unto itself, which, you know, in Frostpunk, it is. The cold is, you know, the enemy you're fighting as much as you're fighting you know, against division of the people, because you, you're trying to keep everyone, you know, united. Uh, then thing on that build. Oh. The children can't build that shit, I don't think so. Do, do, do. Put them right there. So build a get a cookhouse going. Speed that up a little bit. Get those built. Put them on there. Can I actually? Blah 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 blah. Where's where's that? Oh yeah. Uh. It's a lot. So have that going. And then we'll get a hunter's hut. Great time started and... Get the generator online. I will provide some shelter is what I will go. Because they're asking for shelter, I will provide some. thing of there. What do you want? Wisdom of the crowd, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Talking about just basically how people always want, you know, quickest thing, not necessarily the best solution. Kick the generator to overdrive. Get that temperature up. Yeah, nice and toasty, despite no one having a home yet. But I'm kind of going a different strategy, because usually when I play this in the past, I've built homes first, but... I've always neglected the overdrive function of the generator a lot. 
you know, I've not really, uh, used it as much as I probably should in many cases. Uh, do I have anyone on steel right now? Not... So I'll put the kids on steel over there when, you know, morning... Morning arise. I am gaining coal still, but, so that's good. What do you want? People turn apart? Okay, we'll do what we can. And since I need, need a f promise to fulfill... Build two of those at the moment. I'll build some, a couple more tomorrow. But yeah, I don't know. I just This game I just love, though. The whole just style, everything, the generator, it all is just... It's just nice. I remember when I fir this game first came out and I played it, uh... There was only people that were, like, complaining that they beat the game. And then the game was telling them that they crossed the line. And they're like, no, I did what I had to. It's like, no, they're talking about that you kind of crossed the more gray line in terms of how much of a totalitarian dictator you became. Or religious zealot and stuff like that. Because, I mean, when I first beat the game, my very first time I beat the game... The game said I did not cross the line. I mean, I had people dying all over. I did not exactly, you know, play perfectly by any means. I'm not some perfect pro gamer. By any means... Oops. Start with emergency shift. I'm not... I wasn't some pro gamer that the whole game was easy. I... The, I had freaking things were just falling apart at the end, you know. It was barely holding to get, together in some ways, but we survived. Uh, also, eventually I ended up getting the Golden Path, which that was fun to get, even though, you know, there is some randomness to it to some extent, since, uh, I don't think you can get it if, like, you got this, uh, guys die when the, uh, with a bear attack with a cave that you can have. Uh, can I actually... Oh yeah, I don't have that yet. I haven't finished researching it yet. Uh... Okay, for them, I will actually just start their shift early and have it keep going for now. On day two. Got four people in there. Okay, turn off overdrive. Let that cool down. Four people are sick from uh, the cold. Got into work. Use that to try to combat some uh, disconnect, uh, disc uh, discontent I am causing. As far as our food, well, we have uh, have rations still. Fortunately, we have enough to build a beacon. Where is that? Oh yeah, it's tech, 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 tech. Hmm, I'm gonna... I'll just build it right there. Now, what should I do next? I'm not sure right off. I could do steam hubs. Maybe. Heaters. Bean. I think I'll do faster gathering to try to combat some of the uh, difficulty level. It's slowing some of the gathering down. And how much resources do I have for... What do you want? Resource stores? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not now. Well, oh now, but what should I get? We'll just do extended shift. Hear me, hear me. New law in the city. I'm gonna change them to extended shift. Yay, we now have the beacon! This looks nice, nice! Let people out there know we're here. Expedition, which will go there first.
Someone's hungry, huh? Oh, raises. We needed a win, yay. I can't fucking uh, research anything now because I used my resources on the house, damn it! Come on. Well, er, we will let them have the day off. I'm trying to combat some disconnect and uh, turn off the overdrive. Are right, they doing their stuff? I need to make a team, though. Alright, heat, 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 heat. Think, on. Uh, think I'm gonna do the steam hub. Uh, people are gonna get sick tonight because I don't have the power to run the overdriver like it. Oh, a little bit. Okay, no, I need a freaking. I need a save overdrive for tomorrow. All right, so build these. This side here. Oh, crapper. Didn't mean to put that there. Did I get all the resources back? Okay. Okay, well, I got got some resources back for it at least. Today it's gonna drop by two levels. Brace yourselves, cold is coming. Oh yeah. Then. Cold, 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 cold. Oh, we're running out of full. Oh, what do you want? No, we can't afford the double rations for the kids. Much as I'd love to give double rations to the kids, we can't afford double rations for the kids. Alright, and tech, 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 tech. Okay, I need actually two hours to complete that. Oh yeah, so also, I fucking delay in that. I took too long to make a freaking team. Ooh, do you go there? Research. Alright, and steam up 20 steel. Well, we have 20 steel, so that's good at least. I could build right there, but oh. I'll build steam hub right there. And I don't know if this is gonna work like I want it to, but uh, we'll try it. Oh wait, I need fucking laws! Adaptation. Go soup. We want soup! Oh, motherfuckers. I'm just not gonna address that one, because I hate that one. Something always happens that causes shit to go bad. And also, we're gonna kick up our heat temperature for tonight. Try to keep everything. I mean, I'm not doing as bad as the sick right at the moment as I thought I would be. After I research heaters, I need to research sawmills, I believe. Because I'm basically uh, going to be running out of wood crates soon. But no, this is such a bleak game of everyone going. going and blah 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 blah, and stuff happens, and people. Uh, let's put the. Uh, God damn it! Come on. Okay, I can't. I can't build not enough wood. Not a wood, enough wood for the road. 
we we're, we're got everyone a house so far, so that's good. But yeah, I need freaking more food production. Need better hunting gear and all that. Oh, oh, oh! Scouting parties reached the expedition. Explore. It will send them to the city. Let's go look at the sturdy shelter. The shelter. Nice little old job we got going on here. They're they're just perky. Uh, sick people went up. Gonna have more people showing up tonight. Eaters researched. I think I need to get the sawmill first here. Alright, what do we want next? Tree mat. And I gotta get a fighting arena. <laughs> How's my disconnect? Uh, it's not doing too bad at the moment. Oh, do, 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 do. So, radical cre treatment or sustained life? Thirty percent gravely ill. Oh, we'll go with radical treatment. Yeah, I hope they won't cut off my leg either. Steam cores, what, how much do we got here? Food ration, steam core, okay, that's nice. Let's go look at the bridge. We'll go to the bridge, we'll have them come back. Because I need those kind of rations. Yes, first group of survivors. How many actually made it here alive? The families will be reunited, and then they will be torn apart again. And use available labor. How many engineers do I have? More engineers. How much does my frickin' 15 wood of steel? And first, I do need to probably get them into. Health-wise, I think first I'm going to build another medical facility right yonder. It's time I need to build another home as well, get some of these people housed. Reach the bridge. Yay, we have an automaton. We will send it to the city for the quick gain. Another station, large convoy. Watch 16 hours arrive. I'll send them back home because like I said, I need the food that they have for my city. Why is the bridge deferred? Hope falls slightly. Uh, freaking generators. Pulling out. All right, we'll freaking turn the generator down. Time to earn your bread. Time to earn your bread. Oh. I also forgot that we do have our bloody heaters. I researched those. Didn't use the damn things. Also turn the ones in the medical post on just because you know we need them. We need them, big, bad, and good God. Good thing. So I will go over for hunting gear. What do you want? No roof over our heads. I'll provide some shelter. 
Crash shot. We'll go this way now. Night. We will now build some roofs for people. Well, as we need gathering posts there to get that stuff, cause we need the coal. And then, of course, they go out there first. Yeah, I know, I know. I know I fulfilled my promise. I keep all my promises. I got a lot of sick now. Like, I was all bragging earlier. It's like, oh, yeah, like, I don't have very much sick right now. And then it's like, hey, guess what you need? Sick. Uh, one thing I will do... Let's see, you need a... Mm, I mean, a thing. Okay, let's just go with overcrowding, see uh, how much that screws me over. Just get the numbers up is what we're doing. Alright, yay, it thawed a little bit. Alright, that... Automaton is gonna be here in half a day, roughly. More like three quarters of a day, almost between half and three quarters, somewhere on that yonder. I'm too lazy to do the perfect math. But all right. Get going. I'm 28 Get sick right now. Like what's my food situation in terms of I'm losing food, I know that. Well, yeah, I'm losing. Food. It's one of like the bears. I don't know if I want to deal with those right the hell now. Oh well, let's go do it. Actually, get my scouts killed. That either way, we have uh, reached day seven here. We're still alive at the moment. We're not like in the best shape right now because uh, we need more food. We have sick people, but we're not dead yet. We'll see how that changes in the future, though. But I think I will end this episode here for the moment. And I hope you enjoyed uh, watching. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in another episode down the road when our, all of our people freeze to death. Bye for now.